So OnePlus has had a rather busy year, releasing more handsets than it usually would as it attempts to win over new fans on a stricter budget, as well as of course launching the usual flagship devices. But despite that extra graph, they haven't knocked off early for Christmas because just today they revealed a fresh concept phone called the OnePlus 8T concept with a snazzy colour change and back end as dreamed up by their all new international design team. And so here's all you need to know about the OnePlus 8T concept smartphone and for one of the latest greatest tech, please do poke subscribe and ding that notifications bell. Cheers! Now you may remember that OnePlus first shared a vision of a possible smartphone future with the Concept One handset way back in January. <laughs> remember January? Ah, oh, 2020 seems so fresh and exciting, a world of possibility and wonder. <laughs> Anyway, the Concept One was another McLaren collaboration with a luxurious leather style design similar to the Oppo Find X2 Pro, but the standout feature was some special electrochromic glass covering the rear camera. This could turn black to disguise the lenses when not in use, and then shift back to being completely transparent when you actually wanted to take some pics. Seems a wee bit pointless if undeniably funky, but that glass could also act as a polarising filter to temper strong light when you're shooting in very bright conditions. All very well and good, although this was never actually implemented in the OnePlus 8 or the OnePlus 8T, both of which were launched later in 2020, although that's not to say that it won't appear in some future handset, maybe next year. Well anyway, fast forward 12 fairly uneventful months and OnePlus is back at it again with the OnePlus 8T concept smartphone. Whoa, hold up there a second, the 8T concept? But we've already had a OnePlus 8T, so why do we need a concept version two months later? Well, it's because... Just shut up, alright? I've had enough of your sh- The OnePlus 8T concept is an alternative vision of the most recent OnePlus flagship smartphone. It's kind of like Marty McFly's mum in Back to the Future 2 in that parallel universe when she was married to President Biff. She's still Marty's mum, but she makes 11-year-old me feel all hot and funny in my tummy, and not just my tummy. And it's kind of confusing, but in a good way. And I, um... Uh, I mean, to be honest, I didn't really think this metaphor through, and frankly, I'm just going to abandon it right here. What I'm trying to say is that the OnePlus 8T concept is essentially the same hardware as the original flagship smartphone, with one major difference. A big old colour change in tramp stamp slathered across the arse, which is functional as well as attention grabbing, just like that polarising glass from the original concept phone. That electrochromic glass has a thin strip of film containing metal oxide running through the middle, which turns different colours when an electric charge is applied. The colour can be anything from a sort of light silver to a dark blue, depending on the exact voltage that is applied. So by varying that voltage, you can turn the glass specific shades. This can be used for a variety of purposes, such as a, a makeshift notifications light, similar to those flashy logos you get on the back end of most gaming phones, but obviously more energy efficient. And a special millimetre wave sensor located on the back end of the OnePlus 8T concept smartphone allows you to interact directly with that colour change in glass. And OnePlus also mentioned how the concept phone could possibly monitor your breathing and then that colour change in glass could then pulse in time with your breaths for reasons. I guess if nothing else it proves that you're still alive, which is frankly as much as any of us could really hope for these days. New Year's resolution 2021 keep living. OnePlus's press release also stated that the phone's designers took inspiration for these colours from, and I quote, the multi-hued flowing water in the hot springs of the Pamukkale in Turkey. And yeah, it's not that I'm a sceptic or anything, but surely this is the designers saying that they need to go visit glamorous locations across the globe to really get their creative juices flowing. Strange how these boffins never seem to get inspiration from the watercolour at the local baths at Bognor Regis, or the wet and wild in Shields. And speaking of which, this concept phone was dreamed up by the new OnePlus Gaudi Studio, which actually consists of 39 different designers spread across Shenzhen, Taipei, New York and India. And the team is named after the famous Spanish architect Anthony Gaudi, who was most likely on all kinds of shrooms when he designed all of this crazy sh** that he's famous for. Seriously, this man was probably so high that he thought we all looked like ants. But I am really looking forward to seeing what the OnePlus Gaudi Studio comes up with next, and I really hope it's not just more concept smartphones, I hope it's actual real smartphone ideas that are then implemented in real life devices, such as the OnePlus 9, which should hopefully be coming around spring 2021. So that right there is the OnePlus 8T concept smartphone, all wrapped up in a nice little package for you, and padded out with a whole heap of waffle and bullshit. Otherwise, it would have been like a 1 minute 30 video. So if you're still watching, let me know what you think down in the comments below. Please do poke subscribe and ding that notifications bell if you haven't already. And have yourselves a lovely rest of the week. Cheers, everyone. Love you.